Alrighty, took a quick break, and now it's time to get back to this war. So I'm going to want to get more people into that battle. Um, but to do that... Let's see, who do I want to send in? Theoretically, I want to retreat dudes out. Eh, I don't need to retreat people out quite yet. Like, I don't need to worry about maintaining the constants around. And honestly, these guys are pretty beat up. So let's just get them out. The other, the rest of the line will hold. Yeah, in Africa, things are not going great. That's okay. When does your truce with the UK end, buddy? Oh, yeah, a while from now. Okay, well... we we'll just have to maintain this. Yeah, can't push up there. What's this occupy? No, because this is... So, can't push up there. It's about out as far as I can advance without more armies on that front. Now, if they were smart, they'd march in and and beat up these and kill these armies that are uh, gonna cause the encirclement. But okay, drove them off in Cherganov. Good because that army is whew, that army is hurt. Um, this one could probably do with with being more on the front somewhere. I'm gonna send you down this way. And this other army can do the occupation. Are there any states that I've occupied basically all of? And could add as a war goal. Um, Orsha. Okay, I'll go ahead and... Man, that's already... So much war score. Like, I want to make this a great war because it's like 23, 20, so that's, 20, that's 46 more I need, uh, 60, 72 more, which, yeah, can me, yeah, I could do, I guess. But getting a great war would make it just, you know, a little bit, because you know, there's, there's sometimes rounding errors, I think, in the war score that it says you need. Oh well. If I can eventually call in one of my great power buddies. Well, that French army is... Oh, like whenever I check in on this, I seem to have just gotten bad rolls. Good, I won the occupation of Cherganov, which is probably what I'm gonna do for that section. Oh, and this guy will eventually be able to to move somewhere else, because that province is protected. Good. No, Russia wants peace already, but they are not going to get it. Not at all. I don't quite have 50 battle war score, but, you know, war score from battles yet. Yeah, as soon as this arrives at the front, that French army is kill. Uh, 
Yeah, I would really love to make it a great war and get some, like, maybe get a colony out of the deal as well. Like, uh, Volta maybe or something? That would be nice. But for now, just letting this war move on for a bit. Can you go? Okay, no. So I should do that to advance my front. All right, this guy can. Oh, they managed to sneak around somehow. Not sure what they did. Now, if I get to the point where the Ottomans don't have a truce and I want to call them in, I should man this border first. By the way, I'm not taking that tree, that piece off her. That's that's absurd. Not when I have you so much on the ropes that I can I can get it all. Okay, you guys can both withdraw. Recover. They're trying to regain Odessa. How did they get back there? Bavaria, increase opinion, hopefully Germany stupidly decides to like ban me or something. Okay, should be able to beat that army. I think Germany is just going to go for it, and they all have it. Any chance I can get military access since I'm fighting France? No, didn't think so. You probably hate me more than France, given all the land that... Ooh, I can build dreadnoughts. Maybe don't do that while I'm at war, though, and then they try to rally somewhere and get stack wiped. Which, speaking of a stack wipe, there can't be too long left in this. Battle. Oh, here come the Brits again. Those limey Brits. Okay, these guys, these armies can both go help on this front now. And honestly, this would be a good place for the next section of the line. As soon as they're there, I'll attack. Good. Alright, you won your occupation, so let's go down this way. Oh, they dropped me to neutral. That's actually really good for me. That means that it's going to be a little bit longer before they manage to sear them. That's the thing. All I need to do is hold out long enough. We can go to Seoul. 
to stop them from staring them long enough to get this around to work. That's that's my goal. Mm, are the Ottomans gonna do okay again? Yeah, they'll do fine against the rebels. Good. Now I can do this and this. Can I keep building army dudes? Yes, I can. Yeah, let's just build a bunch of, like, artillery. Like nationalists or political rebels? Oh, yeah, they're Bosnian nationalists. So you might want. Oh, we can't really do anything about it because. Hmm. Oh, crisis in Yunnan. That's interesting. Against China? I bet it fizzles out. Given that, uh. Okay, retreating to Balti. That's cool. Given that the great power, not so much of the great powers are already at war. Yeah, no one cared. go. Yeah, that French army is almost kill. And when that happens, like, I actually just, I want to see, like, what their fighting strength change is. So currently they have about 2,200 and I've got 40... Mm -hmm. oh, wow. Alright. That's going to represent a big portion of their fighting force, I think. Oh yeah, and look, these are just all infantry at this point. They're they're about to be annihilated. Oh, UK is trying to come in now. Trying to rescue... Uh, their army and it's attacking here. Sorry, there's a dog barking outside. See, if they were smart, they'd be helping out their French ally by beating this little army here. Just in case, let's give him a leader. Eh, just even that will do. I'll be able to pour a bunch of extra people into that fight if, uh, once I win. God, how do these Russians keep... Oh, I bet they can go down. No, nope, that's not a thing. How do they keep getting through? Are they retreating through my line or something? Is, is that a thing that they're doing? I bet that's a thing they're doing. Uh, that's that's most unfortunate. But that's a, a possibility. That's okay though. But like the armies that do that just end up so isolated that I can crush them at my leisure. Oh, I meant for you to actually get into the lines, buddy. Hmm. 
They're attacking me. Yeah, they're about to be wiped out. And, oh, this battle's almost done. So from 2200, rip. Rip. From 2211 to... Such rip. Oh man. Oh, not actually a huge change on its own. Probably because, you know, the army was actually really already dead, but whatever. No, you can go in here. No way I'm going to be able to get access through Austria, but I'll, I'll, just, I'll see. No, did not think so. Oh, they're attacking me over here, are they? Oh shit, I didn't... I thought I put a new commander everywhere. Yeah, let's, let's put commanders on these guys. I don't want to be great commanders, just... Commanders. Don't screw the pooch. And yeah, so I'm gonna wanna... They're attacking here. Good thing defending in this game is so powerful. And that I have such superior tech. Like, it's that combination. The superior tech and the good defending. That's really gonna help me out. Oh, they don't have a commander either, and they're also attacking with mobilized troops. So... Yeah, I'm not too worried. Oh, now they have a commander. But they're attacking in mountains. You get super entrenched troops. They're not going to be able to do too much damage. Good, good. Okay, well, I think it's time to add another war goal. Let's add Kiev, just cause. There we go. And all the rest, oh, I can already get another army tech. Let's do that. Do it shift click. Because Panama is expected, but West Galicia there. Not so much. Oh, won another huge victory. Yeah, drove off the Limeys. Now, can I safely, if I move to Kursk? Does this allow? Yeah, it does. So I would need another army on this front to expand it. Alright. Send you guys as reinforcement in a minute. Oh, might not need to actually. So I could just split some of these. to lengthen my line and be ready to reinforce if I need to. Yeah, let's do that. So split you, go here, and eh, no negatives at least. You'll do. You're not doing anything super difficult, so... Though actually... 
Could even advance you further pretty safe. Oh no, that could go. So yeah, that's fine then. And then you just defend here, or occupy here. Oh, they're attacking. My army in lunge shoot. Get away if I can, but if not, they can hold pretty well. I would think. Yeah, they're fighting a bunch of mobilized troops. I don't expect to lose that. Okay, reinforce that battle. Should have done a go-to on that, because it could be a general on a critical front. There we go. Defending quite well in the east. I'm gonna need to move some troops though. All my not infantry and a few of my infantry go help here. Actually, not quite yet. Go wrap around here to be ready to help. And then I can reinforce either of those battles as needed. Because they're both still fighting a day in penalty, and that's pretty severe, so... I'll just let them keep throwing themselves slowly against me there. Yeah, stay here. And let them come to you. Good. Fill in more of this occupation. Good. And here. Battle's going pretty well. So... Hold that. And so I guess I'm not going to quite get the victory in, in this session, but... In the next one I should be able to crank that out. Now, if it turns out I can't quite afford the victory, I'll probably just honestly truce break. You know, I already have the front pulled up. It's like, what, one infamy or something? And, yeah. Well, anyway, next episode. Hopefully I'll finish up this war. Uh, if it lasts a little bit longer, I can do something like call in... Well, not you, but someone. Anyway, until then, thank you for watching.